and welcome to an e-demo on face recognition in Victor and Video Edge 4.7 and how it can be used in a unified environment using swipe and show. So the first thing I need to do then is to create a personnel record. I can do that in Secure 9000 or I can do that directly from the Victor Unified Client Interface and that's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to select the Setup tab and then Personnel and New. And I'm going to give this person a first name and a last name. And I'm going to move down to the Images section down here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to upload an image for this person. This is the image that's going to be used for face recognition. There are some guidelines on what this image should be like and they're published on the AD website. If you follow these guidelines it will give you the best possible results. OK, so I can select this button here and navigate to an image file and choose Open. And then I can go ahead and choose Save Image. Of course I could choose Crop Image here if I wanted to edit the image that way. I'm just going to choose Save. And then I also need to ensure that this person can get through the door. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to add Card Access in the Credentials section. Then I'm going to move down to the Clearances section and give them a clearance as well. With that done, I can go ahead and save and close my personnel record. OK, so that person has now been created in the Victor Application Server database, but I need to now add them to the Facial Enrollment database on the Video Edge. And again, I can do this directly from Victor. So I'm going to again go to the Setup tab and Personnel. This time I'm going to choose Show All. And I just need to right click on the person in question and choose Send Image to Facial Recognition Database. And then what I need to do is I need to choose the door which applies. These doors I have here have already an association with the camera. That's the camera that has view of the faces entering the door and it also has the face recognition feature licensed and enabled on it. In this case I'm going to choose both doors and I'm going to select OK. And you can see I've got a confirmation message there which means that the image has been added to the face enrollment database on the video edge which the camera watching the door has been added to. Just choose OK in that box. And now we're ready to go ahead and monitor the door. So I'm going to open up the Swipe and Show interface from the Setup tab. And I'm going to choose to monitor all doors for admits and rejects. And I also need to check this Display Video checkbox here at the bottom in order to be able to see the video from the door. And first of all, I'm going to see what happens when someone who doesn't match the image swipes the card. So when they swipe, you can clearly see that the face here doesn't match the face that is enrolled with the personnel record. And you can see we have a red sad face in the upper right hand corner of the pane that shows the true image. Now if we go ahead and have the correct person swipe their card, we should be able to see we don't have any sad face. And we also have confirmation of the person listed underneath the video pane. And if we hovered over that, we would be able to see their images that are stored on their personnel record as well.